Hey, what's going on, guys? Connor Cook here. Here with a new um, Let's Play on Pokemon. It's been literally years since I've last been series, so I figured we do one now. So um, first things first, though. guys can hear me, so yeah, this is going to be Pokemon Fire Red, uh, it's not going to be a challenge or anything like that, this is just going to be a normal standard playthrough. Uh, okay, so I have to press enter. Right. And then X is the A, the a button maybe? Right, so Z is B, X is A. Well, this is going to get confusing. Uh, new paths will open to you by helping people in need, overcoming challenges, and solving mysteries. At times, you'll be challenged by numbers and attack by wild creatures. Be brave and keep going on. Through your adventure, we hope that you will interact with all sorts of people and achieve personal growth. It's all be subject to press A and then you finish again. So, yeah, basically, if you haven't played a main series Pokemon game, both of them pretty much start off the same, with the same dialogue, just a professor. Uh, of course, I'm going to be a boy, because I am a boy in real life, believe it or not. Uh, so, the characters are there. Right, there's seven characters, so I can, I can definitely put my real life name in there. There we go. Ah! Jesus, X and Z button layout is a complete nightmare already. <laughs> Now, here's the thing about Rival, I don't know what I'm going to call him, to be honest. Um, I've got quite a few friends that play Pokemon, so I don't really, don't really know. Um, is because me and Mitchell, we've been friends for a long time, and uh, Pokemon was kind of how we, uh, we became friends, more or less. Uh, although I would probably say he has a little bit more knowledge on the games that I do, um, so that's why I'm going to name Mitchell. That's why I'm going to name this guy Mitchell. Because throughout the game, that guy's going to be like a few steps ahead of me. There you go. There you go, Mitchell, yeah, our rival for Generation... Well, I guess Generation 3. Generation 1 Remake, so... Right. And as such, since this is a Generation 1 Remake, or Generation 3 game, that should mean that there should be a potion in here, if I'm there we go. Uh, whoops. Okay. Uh, fast. Battle scene on. Battle style shift. Sound. Mono. Frame. Oh, I like frame. Uh, let's have a look at the others. Ooh. I like the blue one. I'm digging the blue one. Okay. So, 
So, yeah, if you can see on the uh, on the background, uh, as you can see, uh, I've, got, I've got two menus. I've got a menu for the Pokemon that I've got on my team currently, and then I've also got another menu which shows all the gym badges that I've got. Basically, if the gym badge has a tick on it, that means I have it. If it doesn't, then it means I don't. Although, none of them should have a tick on it this time, so... So, that much should be obvious to you already, so... So, I guess, first things first is I've got to try and leave town, but oh wait... Who else but Professor Roke uh, is the one to stop me. Um, you need Pokemon for new protection. Okay, fine. Now, I don't know. I mean, I've kind of been, I've kind of been on the fence as to what I want as my starter, to be honest. I've kind of been torn between, like, Charmander and Bulbasaur, to be honest. I mean, I know that a lot of people go for Squirtle, and, you know, it's a good choice. It's a good choice offensively, uh, as it is going to be good against a lot of trainers, but... I don't know, um... I kind of feel like I always go for Squirtle, to be honest. Or at least I always go for Water Pokemon when I, when I play these. I think I'm going to try and uh, mix things up a bit. Alright. So... So of course Bulbasaur is... Um, first choice. Squirtle's the second choice. Bit odd that you put Squirtle in the middle, not the far right. Considering it's... Considering that's where that's how the Pokedex lays them out. You know what, I think I'm gonna go for Bulbasaur because uh, to be honest, it's not very often I pick a grass starter. And also Bulbasaur is just a really, really good Pokemon early on. So I think it's like it's gonna be good against like the first three gyms. Which is insane. And to be honest, the first three gyms are kind of the kind of the big thing because uh, obviously you're gonna be limited as to what Pokemon you're gonna have at the time. Uh, do I wanna give a nickname to to Bulbasaur? Um, I won't, but if a if a good nickname comes to mind then I'll probably find a name rater somewhere and I'll change it there. So, so let's go and have a look at, at the little guy. So it's called so it's Brave Nature. I don't think I can't remember if it's in this generation where nature's kinda kinda matter or if it's gem four. I think it might be gem four actually, so Yeah, it looks okay anyway, so. Okay, let's, let's go and leave now, but I'll grab a battle with Mitch first, so, okay then Mitch, let's, let's do it then, start with you chosen then, Charmander, yeah Charmander, not the Pokemon that Mitchell in real life would have chosen, you know, he probably would have chosen the world, honestly, but whatever, and he needs to have the time to find to chosen me, so, Definitely sound like Mitchell to me, in fairness. <laughs> God, I'm roasting him a bit, aren't I? <laughs> I'm sorry, Mitch. I'm, I promise. I'm, I'm really sorry. I love you really. <laughs> right. I do seem to be doing a little more damage. Fácil. 
I'm using potion on this as soon as the playthrough. I mean, I know it doesn't really match with all this battle, that's a kind of pain to ride to pitch anyway. To be frank, we had light XP and also I'd like the prize one. I think it worked. Unbelievable, I picked the wrong Pokemon. Damn right you did, you should have picked Squirrel. Real Mitch ordered on. Okay, I'll make my Pokemon battle to toughen it up. Connor, Graham, see it, smell you later. Okay. So, guess that means I can go to Route One now. So that's that's good. Alright, encounter a well poked one, and I encounter a ratata. You did okay. Well, I'll battle it anyway. Because, uh, just because I like the XP. Town, Meridian City. Hello. Ah, oh, thank you. Thank you for the potion. Totally wasn't expecting you to give it me or anything. Oh, oh, oh. Right. Right, you. You're a wild encounter, apparently. No, it's right. Super relieved that she finally found some power tap.
lasers. Ledges. I can get them quicker without fear of running into anything. Easy. <coughs> hey Professor, I've delivered. I've got a delivery here. I think it must be them pawn mags that you ordered. Well, I 
don't think I'm going to be completing the Pokedex in this series, Professor. It will actually take, like, a million parts if I didn't want to do that. So... No, that's not going to be my main goal in this series, I'm afraid. Plus, I don't think it's even possible. Actually, no, 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 no. I forgot to go to, uh, Mitch's sister's house. Uh, yeah. Oh, man. You know what? I can't afford for this. Hey. Grandpa asked you to run an errand. Jeez, that's lazy of him. Here, this will help you. Thanks for the town, man. By the way, your your brother's a dick. He said don't even bother asking you for the town, man. Should have words with him. I'm assuming you're like his big sister, right? That he lives with you. Show some authority. again just to see if uh, see if my rival's there. I'm pretty sure he will be now that I've got my Pokemon now. And while I'm at it, I might as well uh, might as well go and catch a Pokemon as well. Of course that would fly. But I don't mind getting into the off of this right there.
again. I really don't like. I really don't like the button on the simulator. And it takes some getting used to. Yeah, they don't charge, they don't charge money, so they're all on the line minimum wage. Feel bad for them. I do like how they, how it's free healthcare here. Here in that though. But at the same time, it does suck for the nurses. That rat uh, keeps using their whips. Oh, and I'm lucky I survived that.
Battles now for against him. So it should start being a little nice for me now. Ah, oh, I just got out. Yeah. I heard the Pope from the UK's crawling. Oh, and then I 
Let's heal up and then try this again. You can never have too many Pokeballs. Okay, what's this over here then? Damn it! I wanted to look at what that item is. If it's, if it's a Pokeball, then I am laughing my ass.
you don't. Looks like you're not getting roasted today. Seriously, there was an NPC in really dark and shiny pearl who said it ran out of antidotes. And then, literally, like six three behind, there was no antidote. Like, couldn't help but lol. I kinda like to uh, get into trainer battles on full health, so... But we'll make sure the rank is full health. Right. Basically, I'm going to create Sounded like you could... Sounded like something could be taken out of context, you said. the guy, haha. <laughs> Ah, uh, I'm poisoned. 
this show of fun, mate. Slow me down as much as, as much as you can. And then whittle my health down. Okay. Is that really all the plan? It's not very good for one thing. Oh, no, yeah. Let's go back to the goals for poison stones. At least I'm not badly. 
back home the way wherever you came from.